Hi guys, my name's Craig Blundell and you join me halfway through the Roland Hybrid Tour. This is my rig that I've been using for the past um, probably three or four months now. Um, I recorded most of the Frost DVD on this and when I record the two new albums, um, I'll be using this setup. It's quite a unique setup. Um, it's obviously the Premier One series, so I'm playing 10, 12 and 8, all by 8, the rack toms, and 14, 16 floor toms with a 20 inch and an 18 inch gong drum. But you can see here I've got it triggered up, so I'm basically every single one of the acoustic drums is triggered up by a TD30. I'm trying to replicate some of the real aggressive raw sounds that we, we've been in the studio. Bass drum's a bit of a cannon. It's, um, it's a 22 by 20 with a four inch hoop on the front, and it's an absolute beast. Uh, also again, with, with a trigger. Over here, which is really cool, I normally put it on the floor to play with, it, play with the pedal when I'm playing some of the brakes and stuff. This is um, uh, an eight by five little snare drum with a trigger on, so it's great for the kind of dubstep breakbeat things. It's re really, really, really impressive. And this is synced up to an SPDSX. Um, you're probably all very fam familiar with the SPDSX, a sampler that I use for pretty much everything I do with all the kind of prog bands that I play with. I'm triggering most of the backing tracks, uh, keyboards, second vocals, etc. It's really, really cool. So I've got the SPDSX um, going into the snare drum and also the gong drum as well, so you can play lots of effects when you play the gong drum. Symbols uh, wise, uh, I'm a bit of a cymbal freak, um, so uh, the Paiste have been really, really good to me over the years. Um, this is a brand new setup that they gave me for the tour, so um, I'm not no normally one for a heavy ride, I, kinda, I like the dark energy stuff, but this is uh, their new metal ride from their custom collection. Uh, it's actually really musical, it's not just like a, a wheelie bin bell sort of sound, it really is very musical. I'm using uh, Metal China as well, 18, over here, I'm using the full crash 18 and the full crash 16. Uh, two of my favorite symbols uh, in my setup, which whatever combination I'm using, whether it's BBC um, or the prog stuff, I use these two. So this, this is the alpha. There's two of them in the series. This is the Swiss crashes. Two, there's 18, two 18s. Uh, I'm using the medium. There's also a thin, which is really cool. And this little baby here, uh, Christian from Peisty made it for me uh, quite a while back. Uh, it's an 8-inch hi-hat bottom, uh, and the day I got it, um, I probably got in a lot of trouble, I put some holes in it, I drilled some holes in it, and put little jingles in there. Uh, so it kind of, it's, it's really sweet because I've got a, an 8-inch china on top, so it's a really aggressive stack. I've also got exactly the same, not on this kit, exactly the same as a 12. So it's kind of nice when you're doing runs around the kit with a double bass drum pedal, you can, I, Approach them as toms, but really top end stuff. They're really, really cool. And these are massive for me. I never normally use 14 inch hats. I'm normally kind of a 12 or 13, even 10s. These are, these are once again, the same collection, but they're uh, 14 inch hats. Uh, and, and they sound really, really, really cool. So um, yeah, it's, it's a really, really fun setup to play. Snare wise, um, Premier made me like my little own signature one-off snare as a, as a little present, which was which was really sweet. Uh, it's a 13 by seven, and this is my kind of main main snare of choice. Um, for most of the stuff I'm doing, it's a real workhorse, and the tunability is really, really cool with it. So uh, on the floor, um, you probably see I'm using uh, a couple of uh, different effects pedals. So I've got uh, the Boss FS5U, um, two on the left-hand side and one on the right-hand side. The one on the right-hand side is, op is controlling the Octopad. I have an Octopad over here to play like cowbells and congas and shakers and stuff, or various loops on the fly. The, the two I have on the left-hand side is controlling the TD30, so patch up and patch down, so changing the sounds of the hybrid kit as, as I go along. Um, my bass drum pedals, you can see they're like spaceships. These are the Malleus pedals, um, which I've been playing for about a year now, and I really love them, and they genuinely do come with me around the world when I'm traveling on clinic tours for Roland and Premier. Um, they are really, really cool. So, And that's my seat, complete with the Portland Davis BC2, so I get everything through my backside, which is marvellous. Um, so this is my setup. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the hybrid tour. Um, I'll be doing lots more of these sort of clinics, and I'll be out and about all over the planet doing my things with Frost and the various different um, different bands that I work with in that kind of prog thing. Um, so thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you soon.